Howdy y'all, I'm Around the Wheel, and based on what my engagement metrics tell me, you are probably not watching Evan's Remains, which is a real shame because it's a pretty pretty intriguing little game. It's, it's pretty heavy on the mystery thriller elements, but I think the puzzles are pretty fun in their own little way too. And I'm not very good at solving mysteries or... Yeah, uh, I are getting ahead of myself or anything, so I'm just gonna let this. I'm content to let this play out. Uh, last time we figured out that uh, that Dysis is probably in some kind of coma, so I don't think whatever health issues she has have subsided, as I previously theorized. So it is okay. It is a hot, humid, muggy night, and we are on World Seven Pipeland. So what have we got? today. Uh, nothing too unusual. Nothing, no new mechanics being used right now. So let's see what we've got. So we go to here and pops that out. Oh, that's, so we're going to have to figure out a way, I bet, to get the platform that is above the bouncy one popped in. So we go here. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. All right. Let's go here. Yeah, there we go. And then this We'll pop up to here. Kaboom. Alright. What am I... What am I now missing? Uh... Okay, how are we gonna get... Where are we gonna get to from here? Can we... Is this... Well, it should be doable. They're all doable to it. Okay. Okay. Go there. Let's pop from here to here. Okay, there's, is there anything down here I need to be aware of? No? Okay. We're going to have to make a pretty high bounce, it would seem. Is there anything we can do here? I don't think we can... Where do we want to jump to? Okay, we go here. Then we go... Hmm. I don't think we can jump anywhere. I don't think we can jump to that top of that pillar from anywhere that we currently have. Oh, okay, okay. So we have to get the... Hmm. So we have to get the zippy platform over to here. And then get this over... Okay, so, yeah, we have to have the green one over on the left, and the bouncy one over on the right, so that we can jump from here to here. Okay, so, that said, how do we want to go about this then? So, alright, okay, I think we need it over here at first. And then we go to here. Okay. And then we go to here. And then get this down here. And go to here. And boom. Easy. Done, 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 done. There you go. Yeah, figuring out what you need to do. You know, it's like reverse engineering a Lemmings puzzle almost. You, you know, figuring it out from the back where everything needs to be placed to succeed then the dominoes kind of fall in line. A water treatment plant? You can drink this stuff now? Boy, they had a lot of technology going. This is this is some pretty sparkly water. I could go for a drink right now. So here we are in the water purification zone. We can't walk past this one. Ooh, boy. Oh boy, this is quite the little zigzag we got going here. I wonder what all this mess translates to. Okay, so. Can I jump in between these? Would not appear that I can. Okay, oh, so you can get on the left side of this thing. I wonder if that is relevant. Uh, let's go ahead and bop it over to here. And uh, let's bring you back here, actually. Okay, get on the other side! No. Okay. What does that do for us? Okay, that gets that going back here. Okay, so let's let's do that thing where we look at what we've 
got. Okay, so it looks like we want to pop out these two that are hovering above us. So that we can get onto here. Yes, we'll eventually have the height to get to there. And then we can jump to the green one and then to the pillars. So we need to get rid of these two. And I'm going to do that by... Okay. Not by doing... Well, okay, alright. Um, let's try going over here. Actually, no. Let's go ahead and pop this back in. And go to here. Okay, you can't actually jump onto it from there. But maybe you can do this. Okay, we got one gone. Huh, I feel like this one is going to interfere. If I jump here, yeah, this one is going to interfere. Okay, so I need to get on top of it, though. Is there any way for me to get on top of it? Um... Well, hold on. So, if we go here, and back here, and then pop this back... There we go. Okay, we can get rid of that now. Okay. Okay. Then, but if we bring it back, no. No, we only want to be rid of the... Okay, yeah. We only want to be rid of these two. So we get... Okay. So then we get rid of... Uh, why do I keep trying to do that? I need the height from this to get onto it. There we go. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So. Bop. Not quite. Is there any way for me to get on top of that? Is there one I can jump on? I don't think I can... I don't think I can get rid of that one by bouncing on... Okay, I need... I need these two... I need... I need these two gone. Can I get on top of that one somehow? That would be an excellent question. I pretty much want to have this up all the time, I think. Unless I don't. Although that really makes no sense because I need the height from it. It's pretty easy to work with it. Maybe I need to get... Well... Yeah, you're just... You get blocked by this every time. So what, what happens if we do... What if we bring it back over here for just a second? Then I have no way of getting back on top of it. Okay, so come here. Well, this might be kind of rough, but maybe we can just go... I don't think we have the air... No, I didn't think so. I was going to say, I don't think we have the air to get from here to here in one hop. We simply don't unless we do. Okay, maybe maybe I should not have brought that back. Maybe I should not have gotten rid of this one. Maybe you can jump from the maybe you can jump from this one to down here to get over to here. Worth a try. Let me see if I can set that up again. Okay, no. I would need to actually just like Okay. Yeah, so I would need to set that up again so that, okay, all right, and then get that there, and then here, and then get this one up, and this one here, okay, yeah, all right, so this goes here. And then you pop the no. I think I may need this one over here for just a second. Well, no, how would I do that then? 
Okay, I, I was super close to it. I know that much. Oh, that was a happy accident. Let's just go to here then. Okay. <laughs> well, that's nice. All right, let's move on then. Hey, Clover's back, and Clover has been... Clover is writing a little more in that notebook than just translations, I think. I think he's keeping tabs on a certain someone. Any sign of the missing one? Oh, yes, my name. You said it. She's just, uh, she's just distracted by all the, the lovely pipe craft going on here. That would actually be the least scary thing to happen right now, I believe. Uh, well, Clover has a self-proclaimed no sense of humor, so... No, yeah. Yeah, this place could be bugged. You know what? Let's save our game. Let's set up a tent. Yeah, you just haven't slept in a while. Have a have a good sleep. Uh huh. Maybe we could fall asleep in one of these pipes. Call tonight. All right, two more monoliths. You get some rest. Just two. Uh, no. My name is Di- I mean, Vanille. <laughs> That's kind of a silly question. Uh, what- why wouldn't you be able to use water- like, hydroelectric energy? <laughs> yeah, that guy. Okay, so I think we have two puzzles left, is what he's saying, and then we get to something else. Okay, so, aha, yes, we have the change of fire here. This is, okay, this one should be fun. Okay, this, okay. So, from here, we go here, and to here. Oh, hey, alright, so we've got, we've got a good looking... Okay, what, where is our... Okay, this one is changed by... Okay, we need to change that one over there into something. Okay, so let's go down for just a second. Okay, we need to change that. It only changes into a teleporter. That's interesting. Okay. So we need to get over to... Okay, let's reset this real quick. So we need to change this to a tele. Do we need to change them both to teleporters somehow? Let's see. Okay. So we go here. Okay, that opens that up. Okay, teleporter. All right, and then we go to here. Yeah. So what does the bottom one change it to? It changes into a teleporter. Okay. So going from here to here. That may have been a mistake clearing both of those out, but let's give it a shot anyway. Okay. I am not convinced that was that much of a mistake. Oh, so now we need to change that one down there into a bouncy one. So, okay. So, boom, boom. Okay. Yeah. And then what? Where do we go to from there? So that one is still a teleporter, but it doesn't have anything to actually teleport us to. I'm still going to jump to it, though. Yeah, it is not active. So, what I would need would be to jump down onto this, but have all of these popped out. I am in the exact opposite situation that I need to be in. Well, that would not even get me all the way up there, though. Um... Oh, I would need to jump from this one to... Yeah, okay, yeah. To get the correct height that I need. So now we go down here. 
Yeah, this is pretty much how it was before. This is a complete reset. Hmm. Aha, there it is. So now I just go from here and then bop onto here. There we go. All right, that one wasn't too bad. All right, just had to kind of look at it for a second. Had to give it some, had to pay my undivided attention to it. And there should be one more after this. And I think that one more would be a good, oh, this is the, oh, we're back to, what word was this? Eternal? Oh man, this puzzle is like so easy that Okay, so, so we do this, uh-huh, and then, boop, boop, what was, what was the way here? There we go, yeah, we just get rid of this. Yeah, okay, we got an easy puzzle, oh, that, that's a word that we've seen before, it was right there in the translations. What word was that, like, eternal? Okay, we're back around to the eternal aspect, I think, of the model, it's, I could not agree more. Well, I don't know about that. I'm kind of pulling an all-nighter here. Maybe the fatigue, you know, started playing tricks on us. No? There you go. Your handy-dandy sleeping bag. And always take a towel, too. That's a piece of advice I've heard. Well, uh, she's got, she's got the best sleeping bag of all. Hardly. You know, you know what? Why don't you just keep your sleeping bag, Mr. Roughing It? Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Lucky devil. Well, uh, you know, sleeping bag, air conditioning. Easy choice if you ask me. I think we've got one more cutscene, probably of the Evan and Vincent nature. No, they're asleep at home this time. And yes, she did make him sleep on the floor. Like a good, strong, independent woman. So they slept. Is something going on during the night? Okay, yeah, I was right. There was an Evan and Vincent scene coming. Which is usually where we stop our day. Oh, uh-oh. Vincent lost. Uh-oh. I mean, I thought he had a trick up his sleeve that... That maybe he would have won the game. But... I mean, he's won every other time, so... Yeah, I mean... He's 100 and 0. If he was 99 and 0, why wouldn't you expect him to go 100 and 0? I don't think he's on any of the national tournament ranked charts. Truly, he is the spy master. Master. You know, that's just kind of the way it is sometimes, Vincent. You try and you try and you try, but. As good as you are, sometimes there's always someone out there better than you. I mean, yeah, you can be awesome at something and not really care, I guess. I mean, <laughs> look at me. I do the best, uh, I do the best episodic playthroughs of video games on YouTube, but I'm, I, I think I'm a pretty humble guy. <laughs> oh, Lord. You've been making strange faces to say nothing, but <laughs> are, are you trying to are you trying to squeeze out a grunt? Yeah, maybe you should go to the bathroom. If tell me one thing. Recognition is for squares, man. It's even more of an achievement to get good at a two-player game when you're alone all the time. Well, time to pack up and hit the bricks, Vincent. You can join the pro circuit, man.
Clover's got it all figured out, man. Now, is that, like, everything Vincent chases, or the general you? Ah! Uh, shame and dishonor on your house, Vincent. Which is not this one, because you lost the privilege of living there. Do what? Uh... What is wrong indeed? And he's just a-sleeping away like it's not- okay. Ooh, golly, the bag's under the eyes. Take a break from the translations, buddy. How did you lose your pillow in so spare a room as this? Yeah, he's used to sleeping on the ground, right? Uh, no way. No bathroom. No bathroom in your own house? So she's gonna zip out to... What? She's gonna take the portal, zip out to here. Oh, ho, 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 ho. what a productive trip to the bathroom. Got you where I want you, now I'm gonna get you. It's still a silhouette, even in this. Oh, this is a new guy. Nice bowl cut, Poindexter. <laughs> you can pee and poop in here all day long. <laughs> oh lord. So maybe we're finally gonna get some answers. Our monkey. What, like? Oh lord. Someone treated me as some paranoid jitterbug when I said I saw someone, saying it must have just been a monkey. Is this the mysterious Evan? Maybe, although I kind of doubt it. Uh, so he's just kind of gone into a trance to avoid talking to you? Too bad, he's in AirPod land now. Yeah, I've never had that work. People still try to talk to me anyway. It works well for you. People around here do not seem to read having headphones on as a sign that you want to be left alone. Not sure why that is. Um, I think your I think your mind reader is busted, dude. Some friends you got there, buddy. 
Yeah, that is super disgusting, especially in these times of woe and want. Seriously. Nobody's gonna give you a wet willy. Unless, of course, that is if you've earned it. So this guy is clearly, like, way spectrum. Andre Ager. Is that another Final Fantasy reference that I'm not aware of? An explorer, although I prefer the word adventurer. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's like the biggest thing going. It's a pretty place, it's quiet, and well, nobody... Well, nobody teases you there. And yeah, it is like the mystery of a lifetime. It's not particularly easy, you know. So he has gotten hold of the notebook, too. I was fortunate enough to touch one of the last notebooks with my own two hands. Interesting. Nothing against taking pictures of it, huh? I mean, that's one way to think about it. Uh, actually, no. But if you have, then... Well, spit it out, buddy. <laughs> Orange peel. Well, okay. Honestly, he just kind of likes hanging around the island. Wow. There's something... <laughs> There's something that would interest you more than the whole eternal life thing. Now, now, here's somebody who's having his perceptions blown. I thought... I thought the things you were chasing didn't have any value, Clover. Now you see me, somebody who doesn't value the thing you're chasing. It's kind of thrown you for a loop, Mr. Hypocrite Man. He's kind of a red herring. He, he just kind of likes... I think he just kind of digs the island, maybe? Oh, that was, that was some other different entirely shadowed figure. He seems pretty harmless, although maybe that's a cover. Why don't you go on about your business, Andre? I am your mother. No, I'm just kidding. We're looking for someone named Evan Goldstein. Does that sound familiar? Evan Goldstein. Whoa, you know Evan, do you? Oh, gosh. He knows him in that celebrity kind of way. Dang it. <laughs> yeah, that would have saved us a lot of time here. Which, uh, which is running up for sure. Boy, 
Boy, somebody is just stealing stuff from you, or you're dropping stuff left and right. Do you have a bathroom? <laughs> it's got grown-up water in it. Also, weren't we just at a treatment plant? Couldn't you get some nice... Couldn't you get some uh, nice uh, desalinated water from there? I think Dysis is going to be glad she didn't drink that water later. Call it a hunch. A little bit of the old Montezuma's revenge if you get my drift. Uh, where are you going? There, there's no door here, Mr. Hoodie Hands. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what I thought. How do you still forget after all this time? Good grief, Dysis. So we're gonna wake up and uh Alright, here we go. The three musketeers. You don't. <laughs> yeah, you run off and do your thing. how much of him we will be seeing again. Bye, Andre. Go on, get. Well, that was something. Yeah, and plus, aren't we in the, aren't we in the nice little... But we seem to be in a different area now. We seem to be in a forest area with, like, the monoliths all seem to be connected in the sky. Being all weird. Should have just gone back to the water treatment plant. Remember when I felt like this one? Oh, drive by pickpocket. Yeah, he was a little funky. Who is Andre Ager, really? The guy whose name anagrams to Dear Reagan. Uh oh. Vincent, Vol, Evan, hmm. Why do I always want to play around with names and like anagramming and stuff? So Vincent is Evan. I'm sure he had plenty of reasons for not telling you. His fake ID? Evan... You know what, I'm gonna have to work this anagram out on my own time. This could be... This could be kind of interesting. Well, you know more than Clover does, apparently. So, Clover is really the one... Uh, he was rummaging through my house for ramen noodles. 
Oh, man. Okay. So Clover is really the one who's in the dark here. That's interesting. Okay. Yeah. Go, just go find a tree. It'll be fine. Use a banana leaf. You'll be totally okay. Are we done with cutscenes for now? Because we are running. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Thank God. Dysis has used the bathroom. Kind of feel like I need to. Let's get out of here.